This is Giovanni Durst and what I'm going to show you today is the first of a series of lessons on how to develop your double bass drum uh, linear fills. What does it mean linear? It means that none of your limbs is playing at the same time. Uh, so I'm going to show you the first one which is a grouping of four notes. Two plus two, two notes played on your hands, two notes played on your feet. And since it's a grouping of four notes, uh, it can be easier at the beginning to count it as 16 notes. And um, there are four ways of playing these groupings. And the first one is by starting playing the first two notes on your, hi uh, on your hands, and then the second two notes on your f uh, feet. So it, it kind of sounds like this. One, and two, and two. The second way uh, is by starting with your feet and then your hands. The third way is by starting uh, with your hand on the first beat and then feet playing the E and the N and the second hit on your hand playing the A. Uh, fourth way, it would be the same as the third, but instead of your uh, hand, you start with your foot. So one and a two and a three and a four and a one. Um, so a way I, the way I did practice this exercise and develop it, it was by playing a drum groove first on a loop of two bars of four four or whenever you want, and then you switch on a one bar playing the fill. And each time you change your fill with one of the inversions that I showed you right now. So you just set your metronome at a tempo that you feel comfortable playing this exercise and here's how it sounds. So hopefully you did enjoy playing this exercise and you can actually come up with different orchestrations uh, using also symbols like uh, symbols that have um, uh, a faster attack like splashes or uh, right bells like something like this. So uh, you can actually come up with many different ideas with this kind of fills. So what I'm going to show you now is uh, the way I do incorporate these drum fills in um, linear fills in uh, different genres of music like metal, like power metal, thrash metal and where they require to be played faster and you can actually come up with very cool ideas.